Yo, what's good, boys? Welcome back. Saints theme team, man. A little bit late on this one. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That's my bad. I've been busy. Then my girlfriend's birthday, and then I was busy again. But we're finally here with the Backyard Brawlers, man. Tomorrow, they're dropping a Cam Jordan on the offensive line, which is jokes that Cam Jordan's gonna be our starting right tackle over Ryan Ramchek. That's just embarrassing. But uh, that wasn't exciting enough for me to wait for that. So we're just gonna do the Jimmy Graham and Ricky Williams today, man. If you're excited, smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Been busy this morning doing the, this pack right here, man. This theme team bundle, dude. $20. I made about 700,000 coins off of that, and uh, I can't really complain. It's pretty good, if, especially if you're, like, kind of just starting. Definitely recommend checking those out. Only 20 bucks, not the end of the world. Way, way better than the $100 bundle y'all made me open on stream the other night for hitting a light goal, and I made, like, 500 grand off of it, so that sucked. But it is what it is. We're going to take a look at these two cards. Starting off on offense, man, we got Ricky Williams at ride receiver, dude. 98 speed. He's 5'10", 230. He has a bruiser on him, but that does not work, man. I had him on weekend league, and he does not bruiser any. Anybody. I don't even know why that's there. He has route tech. He's got good route running, good catching. He's a good receiver card. It's just, I love this promo, man. The Backyard Ballers is a W promo. These cards are cool. This is fun. This is what Ultimate Team was built on back when it first started. It was just fun, random BS. And uh, now that it's been competitive, it's all about having the most meta cards. I prefer it to be like this, where the meta doesn't matter and you can have fun. Speaking of fun, we have a six foot seven, 260 strong safety Jimmy Graham with Acrobat and Pick Artist, and those work. 97 hit power 97 zone all that good stuff this card is good man feels a little slow sometimes but other than that he's really good i obviously don't have the strategy items because my ass just never cared about the strategy items but uh, 97 speed is good enough and he's six foot seven so like what else can you ask for really as for the rest of the team this is the offense if you guys aren't aware this just is always gonna piss me off. <laughs> Having Cam Jordan there is actually gonna make me even more mad, I think. Rest of the offense, quarterback Teddy Bridgewater, man. It's, everybody likes to complain about Teddy Bridgewater, but we get it done. We get it done, boys, with Teddy Bridgewater. So I can't wait till we get a good quarterback. Defense, I do have to have Taylor Mays out there. I just can't stand, I, I can't do it. I can't do it with Marcus Williams and Malcolm Jenkins, man, I can't do it. We have the other guys. Everything else is all pure Saints theme team, man. Uh, I'm working on leveling up so I can get uh, Marcus Davenport. Let me put him back in here. I was adjusting my lineup so I could do all the, all the changes with the theme team builder cards but anyways we're gonna go ahead and jump into some games try to get a w let's get it yo what's good boys just popping in real quick to let you know that i am an affiliate with raise energy if you guys don't know what raise energy is they sell energy drinks they sell supplements they sell protein they sell merchandise they sell just about anything i have a discount code for y'all you save 15 percent if you use code it spits when you check out there's a link in the description if you want to look through their product line my personal favorite was always the watermelon flavored raise energy i drank that literally every single day when i was going to the gym back before covid started and now that I'm getting back into the gym, I'm excited to order myself some more of their new flavors that I've never tried before. So check out the link in the description. And if you order something, take a screenshot, hit me up on Twitter. I'll make sure I retweet and follow you back. Enjoy the video. All right, boys, we're jumping into this house rules, man. This is my favorite house rules in the world because it's one of those ones where like you can't like people have to drop back in coverage. Let's just say that this is a really sweaty version of house rules, but we'll just see what we can do here. We're on offense first. I got kicked from the game for calling a timeout on the first play. So there's that. Uh, what was that about? I literally just was making a substitution. Okay. Okay, EA. Let's see what we're doing here. Next game. Y'all should put somewhere in the rules that you can't call a timeout. That would have been nice to know. Oh, we don't have timeouts. Oh, dang. Okay, I see. Well, then why why kick me from the game then? Why not just tell me, oh, you don't have any timeouts to get wrecked? Like, why you gotta kick me out of the game for? That was so disrespectful. Jesus Christ. All right. My goodness. You can see we're playing against people with yard jerseys. The sweatiest of the sweaty. A little bit of a lagged spin move there by Taysom Hill. You hate to see that. But at this point in the year, everybody's just running the same Tampa 2 coverage. So I, guess, I, don't, I don't know when cover 2 became so good, but that's just all anybody runs now. Especially in weekend league. That was a little bit of a float there by Teddy Bridgewater. Taysom is too slow to find the first down marker. You hate to see that. Now we got to find a way to get two yards here on third down. Trying to find Ricky Williams, but they're not letting him get open. I respect that. That could have been the worst read in human history and also a terrible throw at the same time. Oh my goodness gracious, dude. Y'all ever get to that point in the year where like you just can't focus when you're playing Madden anymore? Like you've played so much Madden throughout the year that you just can't focus on what you're doing? That's where I'm at right now. He's just gonna go right over the top of us. 
because for some reason Marshawn Lattimore wanted to play a 10 yard deep blue. You hate to see it. All right, boys, so we got Jimmy Graham on the user. Gonna try to make a play. I have a feeling he's not gonna throw it to me though. It's just a feeling that I get. Oh, bad defense by me. All right, out of bounds again. Keep getting cheated. Keep getting cheated, bum. Get mad. He's been uh, completely abused. Good job, Vaughn. I need you to dive. I don't know why I don't have Acrobat on Vaughn Bell. When did that happen? Since when? We just played Weekend League. I promise you Vaughn Bell had Acrobat on. I promise you we did. All right, 14 yards. Get a stop. Come on. Okay. Okay, bro. All right. Okay. Well, somehow a 15-yard flat doesn't cover a 15-yard pass. I don't really necessarily know if I understand that. Good defense. Got to keep him out of the end zone. He's going to run that curl play again. Here it comes. No, sir. Let's go, Trey. I don't know if y'all can hear this baby crying, but this baby is crying, bro. Next door. I don't know what's going on. It's crying, though. It's really annoying. Nope. Aaron Glenn got mossed. I hate this game so much. Oh, my God. All right, boys. Game number two. I just hate everything, man. A game where you can just throw it right at defenders and, and score touchdowns. It just doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. But uh, we're back here again. I got... I'm, I'm getting cheated by EA. I'm getting... I'm getting babies crying. Like, I just want to go to sleep at this point. I'm miserable already. This crying baby is going to give me an aneurysm, dude. I swear to God. Okay, well, that sucked. I mean, nobody could get open on man coverage, really. Oh yeah, MT. That was a nice little swerve out of traffic there. I like that from you. Dude, this baby is going off. I don't think you guys can hear it. This baby is going absolutely insane right now. That was the worst throw of all time. Teddy, dude. Now we gotta find a way to go 13 yards on fourth down. It's not looking promising here. He's definitely running Mike Blitz again. Got to get past Cam Chancellor. Alvin, that was a dot, Teddy. I see you, bro. That was a little bit of a dot right there. I'm not going to lie. We'll take those. We'll take those. Dude, how in the... Dude. Oh, my God. How is nobody getting open on this? It's literally just man-beating routes all over the field and nobody's getting open. That's crazy. The thing is you just hate to see... Good job, Alvin. Are we allowed to run the ball in this, or are they going to take points away from me? Oh, I mean, we lost yards anyway, so I guess that doesn't matter. Yeah, I was real proud of his his temp, his little little scheme here, man. He's really proud of this. Four, how is it fourth down already? I swear we just got first down like 10 minutes ago, 10 seconds ago. Oh, come on. Dude, why am I throwing it away on fourth down? Bro, what is this house rules is so uh, frustrating to play. People play so so lame in this. Oh my god, Derrick Henry. He's got Trevon Diggs at wide receiver. And he's throwing a beater. Bro, y'all are toxic as hell, man. Y'all are toxic as shit. Get your feet in, Marshawn! That was a, why did he lob that? That was a terrible throw. He would have had a touchdown if he just bullet passed that. I really need Marshawn to be getting his feet in right there, though. I can't lie. That needs to be a pick. Trying it again. Get out of here, bum. Stop it! Throw a regular pass. Stop looking for posts. Jimmy Graham is somehow exhausted, like he's actually doing something. Okay. He ran a little bit of a wheel route there. Get sacked! He wanted the same thing. I tried to get over there. I don't think I was there in time. Doesn't matter. Let's go. I'm just going to start running code suggestions just because I'm I'm just bored already of running bunch, 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 tray, 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 all this nonsense. Let's just run some codes, dude. Okay, I did not expect that defense at all. What was that? Was that man with zones in the field? It was. Oh my god, this guy plays so annoying. Why are we still spamming Mike Blitz in Madden 22, man? Oh, that was ass. That was ass. That was oh my god. I don't want. I don't want to be here anymore. Back on defense again, boys. 
I'm doing my best to stay calm, boys. I'm doing my best. But I need to understand how in a game that defense doesn't exist, all of a sudden you can just spam Mike Blitzo and nobody can get it. Are our receivers that bad? Man beating routes aren't beating man. I don't get it. His team's not that good. Oh, here it comes. Attempt number 75. Oh, and he got it this time. What a loser, dude. Oh my god, it's covered every time and all of a sudden it's not covered now. All right, let's try this again, man. Hopefully we can f play against somebody that's not a loser, dude. Like, can we just play against somebody that's trying to have fun with Madden 22? Guess not. What was I thinking, guys? What was I thinking? Pete the Sweat. What was I thinking? Are really just going to run with Derrick Henry? Yeah, you can go ahead and congratulations on your six yards. Come on, defense, man. Make a stop. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. We've made stops. Our offense needs to do something. It's not the defense's problem. I don't even know if we've gotten a first down on offense yet in this video. Let's go. Get there. Yes! Let's go. Get sacked. He wanted that halfback corner route. No, sir. Jimmy Graham. Come on, defense. No big plays. No big plays. No big plays. No big plays. No big plays! Fumble! That's a big play! That's a big play for us! Go, Kevin! Oh my god, you're so fat! Let's go, big play. Bro, if Trey Henderson picks that up, it's a touchdown. It's so unfortunate that that was Kevin. Damn, good defense. Who's number 90? Curse? Of course, Mike Blitzo. Y'all see what I'm talking about, dude? It's just the same. We're, you play the same people every goddamn game, man. It's so boring. I just want to play somebody that's doing something different, man. Come on, Alvin! Yes! Good throw, Teddy. Should have lowballed that. That was probably riskier than it should have been. But we'll take it. So I don't think this two-point conversion matters because I've seen people get one point even when they fail it. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. But I guess we'll just we'll just run it and see what happens. That's a dot. Oh my goodness. Good throw. We'll take that one point. Alright, one more stop. Let's go. Can we find a way to get a W in the sweatiest house rules of all time? Jimmy Graham, what's up? What you got for me, Jimmy Graham? Somebody, one of you guys gotta make a play in this video. I haven't thrown, been able to throw it to Ricky Williams yet. Defense, deuce, deuce, defense. Come on, Jimmy. Oh, get spun out of your ass, Jimmy Graham. Jesus Christ. I was pressing X, guys. I was pressing a conservative tackle. Come on, boys. Watch out for the seams. They made me run inside. I didn't like that. Oh, God. No, he doesn't have space. He doesn't have space for that. Yes! We won! We won! Oh my god. Finally. Alright, boys. I'm gonna run it back one more time, and I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I'm gonna try to force feed Ricky Williams if I can. Even if I throw a pit. We're playing the same guy. We're playing the same guy. You know the game is ass when you keep matching up with the same guy because nobody else is playing, dude. All right, so we're gonna run. I'm just gonna run, honestly, just code suggestions, and I'm gonna try to find Ricky Williams. Uh, wherever Ricky Williams is, that's where I want the ball to go. If Pete the Sweat wins the game, good for him. I'm sure he needs it more than I do. So Ricky Williams is gonna be on this little Ziggy uh, route here. And he's not going to get open because that was terrible. That was just atrocious. That was one of the worst routes I think I've ever seen in my entire life. Now, was that going to be open if he ran the route correctly? Probably not. But he ran that route like absolute dog shit. Dude, I have called that play many a times in Weekend League. And he ran that route like absolute ass. Oh, Jimmy Graham, you have 97 hit power. That was absolutely booty, bro. You cannot have 97 hit power and be bouncing off of Chris Johnson. Okay, that is that's not how that works. Oh, um, hello? Y'all want to turn around and make a play? Yeah, we're gonna lose this one. I, I shouldn't threw that pig. Trying to, I saw. I told you guys I was gonna force it to Ricky Williams, no matter what. I told you. Yeah, nice spin. That was trash. Let's go. Keep him out of the end zone, boys. Come on. I'll tell you what, man. Making making videos where you got to force feed players is so hard. I hope you guys understand how difficult that really is to do. Any YouTubers like throwing in them that really successfully do it is because they're good at the game. It's hard. Uh, I play such a free-flowing offense where I'm just throwing it to whoever's open. That having to focus on one guy, I just I just mess up. I, I'm gonna throw the I'm gonna throw the ball into to the other team. I don't know why I couldn't talk just there, but whatever. God, why? 
I sent the spy in a I pretty much I think I counted five dudes just run to the quarterback and leave Chris Johnson wide open. That's fine. Last game. That was it. That was it. GG's PD. Congratulations. Well, that was absolutely horrible. Um, I hope I never have to play that house rules ever again. That was that was just atrocious. Ricky Williams, I'll be honest with you guys, even in weekend league, Ricky Williams hasn't been very good for me. Brandon Cooks is still better, I think. I, I, he just makes more plays. He jumps for balls. He just plays better. You might have a different experience than I do, but Ricky Williams has been pretty trash for me. Jimmy Graham is usually pretty good. I don't know why that hit stick on Chris Johnson was so weak, but Jimmy Graham is a pretty good card. So if you're gonna if you're gonna get one of them for your team, whether you have a theme team or not, I would recommend Jimmy Graham, especially if you have the strategy cards to make him faster. Ricky Williams, probably just not really that good of a card, honestly, but. That's just my opinion. If you guys enjoyed that, smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new here. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.